difficult to interrupt the cheerful Christmas chatter, but we need to take a moment to remember to pray for uh, some families. We've lost a few members in the last two weeks, and uh, so we mourn along with them. December 20, Wilbur Richards, longtime member, passed away. His service will be at Arlington National Cemetery Wednesday at 1045. Please pray for Patsy during this loss and his three daughters. We also say goodbye to another one of our members, and that is Betty Tower, who just passed away this last week. And her service is tended to be planned for January 3 here in the sanctuary. Please keep her family in mind in your prayers as well. These people will be missed sorely. We also have been requested to pray for the sister of Esther Regas, and her name is Juana Tovar. Juana is just recovering from a serious sure. knee injury, and Stop. when people ask us to pray for them, we take it seriously. You'll notice in our bulletin there's a whole list of people, depending on you, to pray for them during the week. So thank you for that. Today, if you're a visitor, I just want you to know across the breezeway over here in what we call a social hall, we're having a potluck, and it is free. So you are invited to eat if you're a visitor after the service. I'm sure you enjoy meeting um, friends and uh, enjoying their food. We continue with our Wednesday night meetings at 6.30. This is called Connect. Somebody said amen. Somebody amen. is enjoying going. I enjoy going. We have food, fellowship, and uh, we will reflect and study on the passage that we're going to hear from uh, Pastor Raywin today. On January 5, we will have a single service, and that means not for single people. <laughs> But single people are invited to marry people too. <laughs> Just one service on that day uh, at 11 o'clock and we'll also be having uh, communion. January 5 is also another very special day because we have named January 5 as a day when we're going to visit everybody. So if you don't want to be visited, you come to the church and be one of the visitors. Okay? <laughs> we're especially asking if you're a church officer, an elder, or a deacon to come that day and uh, be one of the visitors. And uh, just so if you stay home, you'll know when we knock on your door, we're, and we're bringing gifts as well. So, so be there. And it's not like we're going to sit there and drill you or anything. We're just coming to visit, say hello, and we won't stay too long. All righty? At this time, uh, I'd like to invite Pastor Nate up front with us as well. We have the joy of welcoming some soon new-to-be members to our church family right now. I'd like to invite Brandon Baker and his family to come forward at this time, Dana and Jazzy, and I'd also like to invite Joseph Kachi 